Hey everyone, it's Daphne from Scrap and Create, and today I'm gonna to reveal the latest Blue Fern collection that we now have available in our shop. It is called Life's Vignettes, and it's very pretty. I think uh, Jen Bishop is our favorite designer over at Blue Fern, although all their papers are beautiful. So I am going to start by sharing the 12 by 12 paper pack. There are 10 double-sided sheets in this pack. No cover, and it comes that way. So every sheet is 100% usable in the 12 by 12 format. You don't have to cut anything off. Isn't that gorgeous? I can just imagine Fussy cutting these um, butterflies out and using them as a layer. This flower is gorgeous. The colors are super rich, and if you haven't um, experienced Blue Fern, um, the paper is just so lovely. Um, it's super smooth. It's it's quite dense. It's really lovely. Um, I really enjoy working with this paper brand. Beautiful blues. Oh, look at that. That's gorgeous. That's really pretty. Lots to do here. And then even just the background sheet is so pretty. Lots of fussy cutting opportunities, and then usually on the back side, they make it so that you can use it as a background either way. So you've got some choices, lots of cut aparts here. I like that. I'm really liking these sunflowers, very pretty. More butterflies, lovely. The papers just feel so good. This is really pretty. Oh my gosh, I don't know. I would have some of these, I, I like both sides, so I definitely have to have a double, two packs. I'd wanna use both sides in almost every case. Yes, very lovely. So that is the 12 by 12, and you get 10 sheets. In the eight by eight, same sheets, but you get two of each. So the eight by eight has 20 double-sided sheets, the 12 by 12 has 10, and then, this is new, or at least it's new to me. This is what's called a journal pack. Inside the journal pack, you're going to get um, a stamp set and a chipboard piece to use. And it just comes in the pack. Now, the the journal pack is, is uh, it's more in line with a high-end magazine sheet. So this one, filled, the cover feels a little bit more like stock sheet, stock cardstock, but you can see that this is thin and it's only printed on one side. And it's designed so that you could actually fold it in half and make it a journal sheet. So that you could write on the inside, have something lovely on the other side, or you can glue them back to back, but it's much thinner than the cardstock. So it's meant to be uh, journaled on. And then you've got these cut aparts and see there's the, there's the example of the journal, the size that the journal would make. So it's really pretty, um, and I'm anxious to work with it. So basically, it is landscape like this. So I'll go ahead and flip through it this way. And then, like I said, they're single-sided. And you can see the designs themselves lend themselves to journaling or art journaling, where you you know want to sketch or add some additional colors or collages. You've got lots of space to work with. And the, the bold images are on the edge, not in the middle of your paper. Ooh, I love this. So I'll have to go back and look at the cover and tell you how many you get, but you get plenty. So, um, and then a couple of them are these uh, designed to be envelopes. So I think that's very pretty. Um, and so you, you could cut this, you could have an envelope, cut it apart, and glue this on a plain envelope, or you could just fold it um, and make your envelope, you know, open up on the ends, or add, even fold this down and make that the sides to glue your um, uh, sides closed on your envelope. So I'm anxious to try to do something with this. I think it's very pretty. I know some of you are journal makers, um, but it would make a great companion um, pack with a photo album because then you can have some stories in it as well. So again, this is Life's Vignettes. It's a journal pack. There's 12 journal sheets and three envelopes. One three by four stamp and the chipboard piece right here. And I'll try to find a sheet so it shows up. Let's put it right there. There you go. So there's your, it's actually two stamps and then a piece of chipboard. So that's nice. 
interesting uh, idea. I don't know if it's new to them or if it's just a collection that we picked that has it, but I like it. So in addition to that, they've got an ephemera pack, two ephemera packs. Um, this one's called uh, the ephemera pack and this one's called Snips and Snaps. Um, they're both die cut. Um, the Snips and Snaps have 20 die cut pieces and you can see it's essentially black and white sepia. And then the ephemera pack is full color and there's 28 dies in this. And then lastly, they have the bits and bobs and these are four by six, they call them sheets, but they're like cards. Um, these can be used as card toppers, as um, design elements in your book. Um, so the, and I also have found myself fussy cutting elements from it uh, to create texture. Um, I, I would definitely fussy cut those out and I might choose different elements from this to so fussy cut. You've got this one you can split in half for a bookmark. So a couple of different things. So again, we've got the ephemera pack, snip snaps, bits and bobs, the journal pack, the 20 pack of eight by eight double sided. So 10, 10 designs, two of each, and then the 12 by 12 collection pack. So all very, very beautiful. And these are available and shipping right now out of Scrap and Create. So thanks everybody for spending a few minutes with me here and checking out the latest Blue Fern collection in our shop. I'll be back soon.